Hey, welcome back to my YouTube channel, guys. Before you move to New Zealand, you're gonna wanna check out these four services. Now, today I'm gonna overview some services that I use, I've been using, I highly recommend, that really kinda helps you transition to New Zealand, and so you're not gonna wanna miss this video. If that's you, here we go. So this isn't going to be a long video today. I just want to highlight four services that I think is really helpful to you if you are moving to New Zealand. I get this question all the time and I feel like I repeat myself constantly. So I thought I would do this video for you because it's really great. And these are not, they're not sponsoring this video. They're not, you know, they're not receiving any money for this. This is actually companies and businesses that I use consistently as an American living in New Zealand. Okay, so the first thing I have to recommend is my training hub that I created last year. Now, I know that some of you don't love self-promotion, but I truly believe in the products that I create. I spend a lot of time, I did a lot of research, I had a lot of clients, I had all of your questions, and then I created something that I actually solved a problem, filled a need, something that's useful, and I really believe in this. So basically what it is, is it's just a membership. It's $30 a month. I was gonna increase the price, but I've decided not to so far anyway. And so you might wanna get in. Um, and so basically what it is, is there's no other product like it in the market, like nothing. And so basically what you do is you get, it's, it's like this, it's if you are starting a business, you're gonna go into it and you're gonna make lots of mistakes. It's gonna take you a little bit longer to kind of get going, right? But if it's the same as moving to another country. You're gonna make a lot of mistakes and it takes years and years and years to figure things out, to understand, to really understand the culture. I've been here for seven years now and let me tell you, I am still learning, it's amazing. And all the things that I under, think I understood in my first and second year, totally wrong, totally wrong. So what this does is helps you get there quicker it helps you make less mistakes. It helps you come to that understanding, do better with work colleagues, understand how to handle a meeting here, how to get your kids in sports, how to set up a bank account. It's broken up into like everything you know before you come, you're about to come, and then when you're here, lots of culture training. Um, I have other people involved doing trainings as well. Like it's, it's all in there for you. Uh, in fact, I have increased my consulting fees because you know, really everything's in the training hub just get the trading hub. And there's no obligation. I don't say a minimum of three months. I don't, you can cancel anytime. You can go and you can watch what you need and you can cancel. It's fine. I want it to be useful to you. And in addition to all of the trainings, you get a live Q and A with me every month. And there's an online community that you get that you only get if you're in the training hub of all the other people moving here. So this is where you're gonna make your friends. This is gonna make people in the same situation as you where you can ask all of your questions uh, and we've been, I launched it, I think back in June of last year and it's been great. It, it immediately, everybody loves it. And you can also request videos. So like, if you want a video on a topic, just let me know. Like there's no way that you're not getting all the information you need all the time. So it's actually really helpful. Um, even if you've been here for a while, it's helpful. It's helpful. Um, you know, you come here and just have that as a resource um, that's, you know, not expensive. And so I think that that training hub is really good. You should check it out if you haven't, um, or if you think that there's something that would be more helpful, I'm happy to work on that as well. Number two, company or resource that I think is gonna be most helpful for you. The most common question I get is tax. When you're an American, moving overseas and you no matter what country you are you have to pay u.s taxes and this has been a struggle for me i have i've done my own taxes and i've gotten charged 20 grand by irs i have worked with different accountants in the u.s and i highly recommend bright tax like i'm using them i used them last year i'm using them this year i've talked to them a lot they answer my questions and they're very quick what's good about them is that they are based in the u.s so all of their accountants really understand u.s tax law. There, I, I would be surprised if there was any sort of taxes that 
people have to do around the world that are harder than the US taxes, <laughs> especially when you own multiple companies like I do. And so it's really good that they know that, but they're also experts in New Zealand tax and I haven't found better. In fact, the the they found errors in my other ones that I've had from US accountants because they don't know New Zealand tax law. It's not a big country. Like people haven't figured out. So and then also all of the accountants here are very familiar with UK and New Zealand and not familiar with the US. And so if you need tax resources, Bright Tax, even if you just email them and ask a question or like how would I handle this or how should I set up this business? Amazing, could not recommend more. And number three is a company called Wise. It used to be called TransferWise. This is actually also helpful for anybody just traveling here. It's the only way that I transfer money from the US to New Zealand. Now, when you come here, you are going to find that US companies, credit card companies, investment companies, they don't like that you live here. They make everything difficult. I can't even log into my credit card. I literally have to call them from New Zealand in order to pay off a balance. Like if I bought something, it's, it's a whole nother thing. So when you want to transfer money, you know, it's, you need to be able to do it easily. You need to be able to do it often and it cannot cost a lot. I have not found anything cheaper than wise and you should check them out. If you ever need to move, I can like, it normally it says it takes four hours to move money. It's generally less than that for me. And I've been using it for years now. And most of the people around here also recommend it. So no matter where you're coming from, um, Wise is the company that I would use to transfer money between countries. All right, number four, last but not least, I highly recommend a company called Stackery and I've been using them um, for a little over a year now. And let me explain this. It's really great when you move to New Zealand and there's less choice actually. It makes your life a little bit less stressful and easier and like you only get three choices, that's what you get. But over time you can feel frustrated <laughs> that you can't get things that you love or that you miss from the States. And so, and to get things shipped from the States is very expensive, you know, especially now. And the other thing is like you can, you know, when you buy from different stores and then you, sh it doesn't even make sense. It's so expensive to ship from each individual one. So what this place does is that you can buy from all different stores, have it shipped to a address in New Hampshire um, that you don't have to pay any extra taxes on or anything. And they ship it, they combine it all so it's less weight and just easier. And then they ship it to you and it's, they don't charge a lot just to do that. And mm, amazing so you can get all of your christmas shopping done have it sent to that address and then they'll they'll repackage it and make it all um, easy for you um, to send uh, back to new zealand and it's great i love it in fact i if i recall they give my audience a discount if you want to check it out and try it if you're dying for some things from the states you're going to want to check out stackery okay well i hope you enjoyed the video there's tons of other resources that I have on my training hub if you want to look at that. Also, a lot of people ask me about immigration officers. I, my, okay, this is what I tell my clients. You don't need an immigration officer to move here. Like they do everything well on the website. That's my first recommendation. You don't need one. If you do need one because you're comfortable with that, maybe your situation is more complicated, then um, I would use the ones on the immigration site uh, that those are generally pretty good and my clients have thought pretty well. I've recommended some in the past that I'm not happy with them at this point. So no go there, but there's just a lot of resources, a lot of things I can help you with. So don't hesitate to uh, reach out because I'm here to help. And I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you found this to be helpful. Please subscribe uh, if you want to get the video every week and hit the bell for the reminder and I'll see you guys next week.